hey what's up guys in this video we're gonna see how we can pass one object to method as method parameter now to do so we have to define the method and while defining one method first we have the return type then the name of the method and in the parameter section inside the parenthesis we have to write the data type as the name of the class in example if this method is going to receive one object of the student class then the data type will be the name of the class so we have to write student and then name of the variable like student a and then inside the curly braces we write the body of the method and then while calling the method we have to use object dot the method name and then we have to pass the object so we are gonna pass one student type object obj so first we are defining one method which will receive one student type object and then we are passing the student type object obj so now we are gonna do an example program and try to understand how we can pass one object as parameter to method so first we have created one class called student and inside the student we are going to create one instance variable string name which will hold the name of the individual student and then I'm gonna create one constructor which will take one string parameter and then it will initialize the name with that parameter now I'm gonna create the method which will take the object as argument so the return type will be void because this method will not return any value then the name of the method is print name now it will take one student type object obj and inside the method I'm gonna print students name and then I'm gonna print the name of the student so I'm gonna write obj dot name and this will print the name of the student now inside the main method I'm gonna create one object of the student class so I'm gonna write student is equal new student and I'm gonna pass the name of the student so I'm gonna pass the name Tom and then I'm gonna call the method is dot print name method and then I'm gonna pass the object is so now I'm gonna save this program and I'm gonna compile and run the program and you can see the output student's name Tom so first of all we have one string name which will hold the name of the individual student and then we are using one constructor and receiving one string and initialize that name with that string and inside the main method while creating one object we are calling the constructor and passing the string name Tom so the constructor will receive the Tom and initialize the name variable with the name Tom and then we are calling the print name method and passing the object is as argument so the object will be received here as obj and then we are accessing the name with object dot name and printing the student's name onto the console so to pass one object as argument we have to set data type as the name of the class and this is the way we can pass one object as argument to the method. So hope you understand the concept. We'll see you in the next one. Thank you.